In today's video, we're going to show you how to play any PC game on any device, anywhere, anytime. Does that sound too good to be true? Well, it's not. It's here and it's called Shadow. So a little bit about the details of the Shadow PC. The Shadow PC is essentially a computer that is hosted for you by the company Shadow. You pay a minimum of $12 a month and that gives you a GeForce 1080, 12 gigs of RAM and even those who require a little bit more than a 1080 graphics cards or even more gigabytes of RAM, those are options that are available and I'll leave the link so you can check it out for yourself down below. Um, a couple things to note, this video is not sponsored by Shadow in any way. I'm simply an end user and I I love the product. It's super awesome. If you're someone who lives van life like me or someone who's on the go and wants to carry their gaming console with them at all times, anywhere, you can do it with Shadow PC. Um, another thing to know is that the Shadow PC is keyboard and mouse compatible. So if you're a keyboard and mouse player, you can use that with the iOS system or your Mac at home or your Windows PC. It will definitely work. And people have even used Shadow PC to play VR games, which is in sync. Also, another great thing about Shadow PC is that the computers that they use are continuously updated. So in four years from now, when there's a better graphics cards available, maybe more RAM available, your PC that you have will get upgraded. So you don't have to go out and hunt for a graphics cards or a better a CPU because the company Shadow themselves will upgrade your PC. So you're always at the top of the line whenever the new games come out. So you can run anything on Shadow PC. Leave a comment down below, where would be the most awesome epic place to do some gaming? And leave it down in the comments below and maybe I'll take my Shadow PC and play some games out there. All right, so during this portion of the video, I'm gonna walk you through how I set up my Shadow PC. If you're looking to see the gameplay and how it works, I'll leave a link down below so you can kind of skip ahead or I'll put it somewhere on the video or in the card so you can skip ahead and see some like actual gameplay. So the first thing you need is you need to have about a 15 megabytes per second um, internet speed. So here I am at speedtest.net and we can see that I have about 14.5 uh, down which is just about the minimum what you'll need um, and then upload speed really doesn't matter uh, I, I've seen it with three or five megabytes per second and it works great so that connection wasn't ideal so we're gonna try the hotspot from my phone I am using AT&T and we're gonna see if we get any better signal with uh, the hotspot via the AT&T network um, usually it's pretty good around 80 to 100 megabytes per second, but it all depends on the time of day and where I'm at. So it looks like we're a little bit better, 25, which isn't bad. Um, not the best I've seen with my hotspot via AT&T, but definitely workable. Okay, so we're connected to the iPhone network. So now let's go ahead and scroll to the Shadow, Shadow app. Um, so now we're just going to let this load. And I've used this in public places, just like around town. Uh, Starbucks works really well. McDonald's has some sort of filter where it doesn't allow you to connect. Walmart works great. So now the PC is loaded, doesn't take too long. And the image that you're seeing is basically just a stream of the computer that it's connected to. Um, and real quick, we'll check the speed from the computer that it's connected to and it's usually about one gigabyte down and like something crazy up that does like insane speeds that they're connected to over at their servers so it's really great and for the upload like 100 megabytes up which is absolutely insane um, really high speeds whenever i'm loading into like warzone games i always seem to be the first one to load in because it's so you know connected so yeah, for those of you who are interested, um, you can see the tech specs here real quick. So it looks like it's running an Intel um, 3.2 gigahertz. Uh, we got about 12 gigs of RAM. And um, so here Shadow has like a quick menu and you can adjust how much data you're allowing Shadow to use. Um, I usually set it a little bit lower to five megabytes a second so I can save the data plan on my phone. And typically that'll be about two gigabytes per hour of gaming. So boom, we're loading in. We'll skip ahead a little bit. Yeah, cool. So anyway, let's get into the gameplay. Here I am at a park 
and it's absolutely gorgeous out and here I am playing Warzone on my iPad via iOS. So I also have a little bit of a better connection here. So I'm using my iPhone as a hotspot and uh, we'll, show you sh we'll show you some real life gameplay. So see as I kind of toggle the stick side to side, there's really no input lag. Um, as soon as I hit, you know, like B to cut the, or X, as soon as I hit the button to cut the parachute, it's cut automatically. So no lag as far as input lag. Sorry, bro. I know that was weak. But. So yeah, it's, it's running great. And I can do this at the beach at the park, wherever. As long as you have at least 15 megabytes per second, um, you can do it. The one downside is that it's constantly streaming video, so it does suck up a ton of data. Whoa, totally missed that guy. He has no idea that I'm up here, though. Sorry, bro. <laughs> this is so much fun, you guys. It's so crazy. Whoa! Whoa, that was intense. Oh my gosh. I'm not, I'm not a great player, you guys, so don't judge me on that. What? That was not good. Sorry, I know that was so cheap, you guys. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I know that was just like not, not very good gameplay to watch. Oh my gosh. Are they back over there? <laughs> Not again. I'm sure that's what they're thinking. Oh, what? Did I kill myself? I'm like so bad at that. So as you can see, it's totally seamless. It works great. And I can be anywhere. And I can catch some dubs on Warzone. <laughs> or get owned. Both are good. All right, so there you have it, everybody. That's how I'm able to play any PC game anywhere, anytime with Shadow. Again, I am not sponsored by Shadow by in any way, but Shadow, if you're out there and you wanna sponsor me, please do. <laughs> I love the product. Couple bad things is that it takes a ton of data because you're constantly streaming the video. So you're gonna need uh, to have some sort of unlimited data I'm a very casual gamer, so I don't need that much data because I'm not playing all the time. And your connection has to be pretty strong, at least 15 megabytes or higher to be able to stream and not have any issues. 
one more thing is that this product is in so high demand that the wait list to get one of these is super long so if you want to get one sign up right away i'll leave links down below in the description it'll take you a few months for you to get your shadow activated but once you do don't get rid of it it's great so that's how i'm able to play games anywhere on the go while living in my van let me know what you think down below in the comments if you play warzone add me and let's catch some dubs all right everybody thank you so much and we'll see you next time peace